When the skin is damaged, in this case caused by UV sunlight, the response is an increase in melanin. The result is hyperpigmentation or melasma. Damage from the sun, aging or injury upregulates vascular endothelial growth factor or VEGF to increase vascularity to aid healing. A receptor for VEGF exists on melanocytes, resulting in the upregulation of melanin production to create hyperpigmentation. Hyperpigmentation occurs as a direct result of upregulation of VEGF following skin damage, sun exposure, injury and using laser therapy are examples of this damage. Chronic melasma damages the dermal junction, leading to dermal melasma. Sun exposure is a prime cause of melasma. VEGF upregulates stimulating angiogenesis. Now VEGF attaches to the melanocyte receptors. This increases melanin production, resulting in hyperpigmentation. Downregulation of VEGF reduces melanin production, thus reducing hyperpigmentation. VEGF occurs deep in the dermis and is out of reach for conventional lasers, drugs or creams. All these regimes cause side effects. Let's take a closer look at the adverse side effects of lasers. Conventional laser treatment is either ineffective due to a lack of power to penetrate the dermis or when more power is generated to reach the dermis cellular damage occurs thus increasing hyperpigmentation. You have seen this effect yourself. The internet is awash with patient accounts of melasma getting worse post-treatment from lasers. Conventional dye KTP or YEG lasers deliver their power with a destructive action. Every kilowatt is delivered in one short explosive pulse and any attempt to go deeper requires more power which causes damage, upregulates VEGF and the melasma exacerbated. Optimal treatment dictates 3 kilowatt power to reach into the dermis but micropulse energy to minimize collateral damage. Fast Edge Micropulse FEM produces 3 kilowatt pulses, each of 90 microjoules, thus causing no thermal damage. The Joule Yellow produces 22,000 such pulses each second. FEM enables yellow light to be delivered into the dermis targeting VEGF using 3 kilowatts without damaging the skin. The key is the delivery of micropulse energy. Other lasers deliver all their power in a single pulse. An FEM enabled laser evenly distributes a mass of small packages of energy while using enough power to go deeper into the dermis to eliminate VEGF. It is exactly the same principle that allows people to firewalk. Distributing energy combined with motion can make energy harmless. Alternatively, if you concentrate energy, that's where damage occurs. FEM produces 22,000 micropulses of yellow laser light per second. This creates a mass of energy packages. Distributing the power evenly as you slowly move the laser during treatment. Delivering energy deep into the dermis to effectively treat melasma. Reducing VEGF attached to melanocytes. FEM technology produces 22,000 micropulses per second. Each pulse is 3 kilowatts and 90 microjoules of energy. Here you can see the treatment results from an Asian patient. The presence of VEGF is plain to see. After four treatments, 
you can see the dramatic reduction of VEGF and the results are available for the world to see. This example is just one of thousands of successful treatments in 30 countries. The proof is conclusive. Currently, the only laser on the market with FEM is the dual yellow multi-wave length laser.